Hey, how's it going guys? And welcome back to another meme review. And today's meme is a very popular one in our sphere of YouTube, the uh, commentating political side of things. And this is of course Steven Crowder's change my mind meme. Now who is Steven Crowder and what is this meme and why is this meme a thing? Well, Steven Crowder is a conservative pundit and also a comedian. He's not very funny actually. None of his sketches are remotely hilarious to me. All he seems to do is think if he dresses up in drag, that equals funny. You've also got to, you know, tell jokes, but he's not very good at telling jokes. But that's my opinion. You can disagree. Oh, I'm better than you. Oh. Yeah, just just not funny. But nonetheless, he is strangely memeable for somebody who I don't really think is very funny. So what is this mean? Well, apparently he has some kind of video series on his channel where he just goes to different universities or into public places, sits at a desk with a banner and invites people to debate him and change his mind on topics. And through this series he's managed to get some debates and post them on his channel. Something very good, something you don't usually see because he will get far leftists on and he will talk to them. And it seems to be a hit. And he seems to find willing people in public, which is pretty brave because I wouldn't do that kind of thing. I, I'm just, I'm not into that. And this meme came about through one such topic and basically he sat outside a Texas university and the topic of the day was male privilege doesn't exist, change my mind. And it wasn't just the fact that the banner was there, a banner alone does not mean that you're going to be memed. There has to be something else in the background or the foreground that makes it liable to such change. And with this, it's Crowder's position. It's Crowder just laying back with a nice cup of coffee and just, <laughs> just enjoying life. And that created the meme. So uh, let's just take a look at a few examples and see how dank this meme is. P stalled in the balls. Change my mind. Well, <laughs> that's interesting. P stalled in the balls. I mean, I guess there is some logic to this, but let's move on. Putting memes on a t-shirt is okay. Change my mind. God damn, Redbubble, stop shilling. I don't need you shilling on my video. I've not yet been able to use this website for merchandise yet. Stay tuned. This is fine. Change my mind. <laughs> it's fine, right? It's fine. Bats are bugs. Change my mind. Well, Calvin and Hobbes. <laughs> it's pretty cute. It's pretty cute, it's probably the, the most cutest one yet. So it's pretty clear from this meme that it doesn't just have to be Crowder that has to be in the meme. You can put anybody's face over his face and it will work. So it's got some variety to it. Although not a lot as there's not much you can do with this meme sadly. Only money will do, change my mind. Crowder's will do fine. <laughs> Only money will do, change my mind. <laughs> I don't quite understand why they've had to, you know, repeat only money will do when he's saying credits will do fine. But then again, I guess that's pointing out how stupid the Phantom Menace is, but I haven't watched the film in a while. Hitler did nothing wrong. Change my mind. Of course that has to be written on there. Change my mind. Change my mind. <laughs> dank. Your mom gay. Change my mind. Oh, dank. Pluto is not a planet. Change my mind. No. Pineapples don't belong on pizza. Change my mind. And if you don't have bones in your chicken wings, you're not a real man. Change my mind. Traps aren't gay. The dick make it cuter. Oof. Oof. Oh. I'm not going there. And Jared, I think, is like one of his co-hosts, I think. And apparently this is a meme within his like community. And apparently Jared is not gay. Change my mind. I like the new change my mind featuring not gay Jared. Okay. All right, cool. I'm having a brain transplant. They're going to change my whole. <laughs> Dang. I like that. It subverted my expectations. It flipped the meme. So their mind was going to be changed after all because their brain was getting transplanted. Hmm. I think this one was posted by somebody on Shoe On Head's thread and it says, your wife is trash, change my mind. <laughs> I love this one. It's got the uh, the pillow and it's got Crowder. You know what? They're made for each other. Look, look. I think he actually has one in his room, you know. I think he actually has one. I mean, it doesn't even look out of place with him. 
Are you telling me that he's definitely not a weeb? So as you can see, there's not really a lot of room to manoeuvre with this meme. You can kind of go in an image macro kind of way with that Star Wars meme. You can change Crowder into different characters, but other than that, the meme is kind of the same. It's kind of samey. There's not really anything that you can cross over with and transform the meme and turn it into something even danker than it kind of already is. Plus, it clearly won't have much of a shelf life because there's only so many times that Crowder can continue to use these kind of billboards and uh, placards in his videos and people can only edit it in so many ways. But, you know, maybe the fact that you can come up with all these different statements, on the other hand, even though you can't exactly, you know, increase the life exponentially of this meme, the fact that any statement can be put on it that can be debated suggests that for a little while yet, it has some uses. I'd give it 6 Crowder getting punched out of 10. And uh, with that, we'll end this meme review. So anyway guys, that's the end of this video. If you liked what you've seen, smash the proverbial like button, comment, share the video, that is always important. And if you would like, you can donate to my Patreon and make a support, which without that, this would not be possible. So until next time, it's been your boy, and I'll see you later. Oh,